Hello everyone, welcome to Sonic Superstars, well, in approximately four minutes anyway, but here it is, I'm very excited to get into it, but of course, as this is a modern Sonic game, not any fun retro game, we have to first wait for the game to uh, copy off the disc for some reason. I don't know why that's necessary, but it is what it is, so we have to wait three minutes, and... Man, I was panicking so much before this stream started, oh my god. So, first of all, uh, the PlayStation wouldn't connect to the capture card because it had some copy protect link on it from when I installed Twitch recently, so that was fun. And uh, I got my girlfriend to figure all that out while I quickly went for a shower because I hadn't had time to have one today because I've been literally so busy since the minute I woke up. So, we're here and now I have three minutes to just relax. Chat to you guys if anyone's here. How's everyone's days been? I've been itching to play this all day and there is a spider crawling across the desk. I just threw him on the floor. Has anyone else had a chance to play Sonic Superstars just yet? I haven't, but I'm very excited about the uh, idea of doing so in exactly 91 seconds. So... Come on, not exactly the very exciting start to this video that we were hoping for. And my phone is being stolen, and I do not have a drink. <laughs> I think she was using my card for something. My hair's still wet. I literally just put my headphones straight on. Good evening. Let's see who's in the chat so far. Mark B441969. Uh, evening. Not yet. Too much of a backlog. I feel you, but any Sonic game deserves um, immediate play. Well, we're still waiting for that, I guess. I can go on to... Do we have camera mode? Yeah, we do. We don't have chat, but we have a camera. I can show you some of the other stuff that I've picked up recently. So, uh, at EGX, uh, last weekend, I picked up this for the Game Boy Color. I've also picked up Harvest Moon 2 for the Game Boy Color recently. Which I actually played on the train on the way to London, and I was really enjoying it, so... Really like the Harvest Moon uh, Game Boy games. And... There's one thing in particular that I really love about these games. I'm going to see if there's anything in the instruction manual that I can show you. And it's such a weird thing that I don't think most people would care about, but... Oh, is there not going to be a picture of it? Oh, now we have to wait for an update file as well. Oh my god, modern gaming. There is no picture of it. Anyway, I was basically going to say I love the uh, character portraits in the Harvest Moon games. And if you want to see why I was complaining. Still waiting. Let's go back onto full screen cam and talk for a bit longer. I've also got this to play at some point in the near future. Saber Wolf. So I am very much looking forward to giving that one a go. And the uh, final game that I picked up recently, I didn't realise this was going to turn into a pickups episode straight away, but the other game that I picked up the other day at EGX was Croc 2 for the uh, Game Boy Color as well, which surprisingly has a very thick instruction manual, which you would not expect for such a simple game, but look at the size of that. I guess it's all different languages because it's the European version, but... Weird that they've stretched the uh, screenshot out of its Game Boy Color aspect ratio. I wonder what that was about. But I really enjoyed the Croc games on the PlayStation 1, so I really don't know what to expect with the Game Boy Color one, but I have that now, so maybe I'll check it out in the future, or at least it can be included in the pickups video. Let's see how long we've got left. We've got four minutes left. Unfortunately. I could start without updating, but I presume something bad will happen if I do that. Pop back onto camera. I can show you the box while we're waiting. There we go, Sonic Superstars. Super fast, super fun, superstars. And inside, I have... I better cover up the code, but I have a DLC thing. If I want to play as Dr. Eggman. A Lego version for some reason. There's also a little leaflet in there about the Lego the Sonic the Hedgehog collection and something I was very disappointed about 
there is an instruction manual, which is very surprising to see, but it's literally just that in like 10 different languages. And I thought it was really, really sad. And then there's a few notes pages in the back because you've got to use notes pages. There you go. Go and do it. I'll hold this here for three minutes until we've installed the game. I'm just passing the time. Look. Oh, lame. lame. I was so excited about doing this as well. And then it had to copy the game onto the hard drive because it doesn't want to play games from the disc. And then it has to update the game. Resi. Resi's in there, safe and sound. There it is, look. Resi 4's in there, safe and sound. Talk about Resident Evil and how good the DLC is. Huh? Talk about Resident Evil and how good the DLC is. You can tell everyone. No! They don't need to see you. Play Resident Evil 4's DLC is really, really good. There you go, you heard her. Go and play Resident Evil 4 DLC. What's it called? Separate Ways. Go and play Separate Ways. <laughs> What's it called? I actually really enjoyed it. Almost more than the main game. You said more? More than the main game, yeah. It was very fun. It's kind of like Spider-Man Resident Evil style. <laughs> That's what you said. Yeah, it is fun. You get to play as Ada using your grapple hook and stuff. Right, we are nearly there. 60 seconds to go. Oh yeah, I've also got my chow joining me on this stream as well. And if I go back on camera for a second, I can show you this Friday's video. is all about Sonic as well. I was talking about Sonic Adventure 2, the Dreamcast version. So this Friday, if you like Sonic, check out my video this Friday for lots of uh, lots of me talking about how much I love Sonic Adventure 2. And Battle, obviously. Who doesn't love the uh, GameCube version? Anyway, we are almost ready to play! We've got 15 seconds left. We've got some more people here. Head to Beastie. Hello. And narrator, narrator, but cool. And I got my sonic energy. We still can't play it. All right, it's updated. Let's do this. I hope there's no more updates or anything I need to worry about. I just realized I haven't turned my lights on. There we go. Now we have some fun lighting in the background. Hopefully the sound's okay. We've got a very fun introduction here. Ah, oh, I love this already. I guess this is like Sonic Origins style. I haven't got enough space on this desk for everything. Let's try that. I'm so excited. I've been looking forward to this game for a long time. Well, since it was announced. It wasn't that long ago. Anyway, here we are. Sonic Superstars. We've got a really nice title screen here. It looks like there's a character missing in the corner. So, what do we have here? 
carryover from PS4, PlayStation Store, web manual, and options. We don't need any of that. Let's get straight into the game. And we have some Sonic 4 style music going on here, which is a bit odd. Although, I'm one of the few weird people who actually likes the Sonic 4 soundtrack. Both Sonic 4 games, honestly, so I really don't mind. How's the sound? Is my microphone okay? Because it's, uh, it's been a bit awkward. Let's try that. Of course, we're going to play Sonic. It is his game, after all. We get to enjoy a really nice cartoon cutscene to begin the game. Is there any story? It doesn't seem like it. Eggman angry. Sonic's on the loose. Fang stole an animal and he's taunting them. Ooh, I like that. That is a nice intro. Okay. Controls are really nice so far. Wow, this does feel really good. This is probably the best that a uh, 2D Sonic game has felt. Uh, 2.5D Sonic game, should I say. I wasn't really sure how I would feel about the really zoomed in camera, and I do feel it is a little bit close. Quite vertical level design as well, which is kind of different. Oh, there was something over there. And some kind of special stage or bonus room. Catch the medals. Ooh, this is new. It almost looks like a... A Smash Bros. minigame. Ooh, I like how smooth it is. And you can see the other ones in the background too, that's cool. Weird music, it's kind of like a slow version of the Sonic 1 special stage music. I wonder what these medals are for. Yay, we did it! Are they basically the Chaos Emeralds? Oh, I like that. I like that sound. And we got a trophy. Whirly gig world. Okay. So, where I was actually going was back here because I saw that. Let's see what this does. Is this another special stage? I'm not going to be doing much platforming. Okay, we got a chance to get a Chaos Emerald. Cool. Press and hold X. What's going on? Am I supposed to be... Aiming for things? I'm just sort of homing and attacking on it, that's weird. What a strange special stage. Well, we did it, we got one. I didn't have to try much. And new power. What does that mean? Avatar. We got some stick figures. Now what's going on? What the hell is this? Summon a clone to attack the enemies. Select emerald power with- Oh, what is going on here? Activate emerald power. Whoa! Okay, that's what we saw in the uh, in the trailer. Okay, cool. Apparently, I have an emerald power. Can I use that whenever I want? Ow! I was trying to go up there. Maybe I missed my chance. So, what does everyone think of the game so far? Maybe it's a little bit too early to tell just yet, but I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying all the random things that I didn't know about. 
We got, we got something. And there's another special stage there. I'm not sure what these memoral, memeralds. Oh, what's going on now? This is another different one. Cool. I'm not sure what these medals are for. We didn't even get one that time. Whoa, this is this is crazy. There's all sorts of all sorts of weird stuff going on. I'm not going fast enough to get. Whoa, why is there a gold crab? What's that about? There's another m medal. I keep wanting to call them emblems. There's special stages everywhere. What the hell? Hey, Pastor Plunger, how are you doing? Right, catch the medal. So now we have to do the same thing we were doing. To get the emerald. There's some very strange stuff going down. Also, hi everyone. Uh, medals are for outfit parts and multiplayer or something. Okay, well, I just got five more. Looking impressive so far. I'm impressed. I feel like the gameplay has been interrupted every few seconds with throwing new stuff at me. So hopefully that calms down a little bit soon. But... Oh, the controls are just spot on. I'm so happy. It feels fantastic. Really nice smooth frame rate as well. Honestly, no complaints yet. Whoa. This bit kind of reminds me of Sonic Generations for the 3DS. When they did that 2.5D version of... Uh... Oh my god, no! I'm uh, playing the PlayStation 5 version. There it is. So I don't know how it compares on other systems. Apparently, the Switch version plays at 60 frames a second, which I was quite surprised about. Considering that all the previous Sonic games on there have played at 30. Okay, I need to be... careful. Here! Because he's going to destroy the floor. Ah! Ah! Oh my god! Why was there a giant penguin at the end? Hey, there he is. Did I save all his babies? I hope so. Yay, level one complete. Man, I'm loving this so much. Uh, that's okay, no worries. You can't be expected to remember everything you see online. There's a million things that everyone sees every day. Let's go! Oh, I like that as well, the sunset in Act 2. Very nice. I'm enjoying the music too. Very upbeat. Whoa! Okay, cool! We got like a Sonic Advance 2 style extra like shadows behind the character. Whoa! Okay, don't question the physics of that. We've got another bonus stage now as well. What type? It's going to be another one of them throwing yourself around ones. Really interesting concept for a special stage. I'm not sure whether I like it or not. I'd say the, the running ones in Sonic Mania are probably my favourite. Uh, the game was a bit quiet, sure. How's that? That should be okay. Well, I'll wait for it to come back on. All right. When the when the uh, game starts up again, let me know how the sound volumes are. Is that good? And then if I talk, it should go down a little bit. Or does it need to go up even more? Whoa, what's going on with this? Um, no, I didn't make a video about Sonic Frontiers. I still haven't really decided what I think about that game. I did complete it, but half of me thinks it's good, and the other half just thinks that it's really in need of a lot more work. Sure. We'll try that. Goes out for everyone. It's really difficult to judge how the sound is on Twitch. Because obviously you can't hear the stream when you're streaming, which makes it impossible.
Whoa, what's going on here? Whoa. It didn't do much. Awesome. Thank you for letting me know about the audio. I always appreciate it when people do that. We've got our first boss fight. And the Sonic 4 style music's come back again. Oh no, this reminds me of the fight at the end of Sonic 2. With less spikes. Funky music. I know some people really don't like this. Uh, Sonic 4 style. But I don't mind it. Ah! Chance to attack? Yes. I was half expecting... Oh, cool, we got phase two. I've, I was half expecting another take on the uh, Sonic 1 style boss. So I'm kind of glad they're not leaning too hard ah, into the nostalgia in this game. So far, everything seems quite new and unique, which is good. Oh, cool, we do have the uh, drop dash. Oh, and a roulette wheel as well, that's new. We got some weird bean. Oh, yeah, I'm very much looking forward to Mario Wonder. I've got that pre-ordered as, pre as well, so I'm hoping that I can complete this game in three days. before Mario Wonder comes out on the 20th. And I might stream that next week. I'm a huge fan of 2D platformers. I always get excited when a new when a new one comes out. And I'm so glad that Sega and Nintendo are still making them because they could have easily gone all in on 3D and not made games like this, you know? So I'm just glad that people still do. Whoa, this one is... Uh, Giving me Sonic CD vibes. Yeah. Um, I can't remember what the level's called. The one that's in the city. Whoa! Okay, that's a new... A new gimmick. <laughs> and that! The dragonfly's running off with the uh, TV screen. I like all this rail grinding. I don't like that frog! They reminds me of some of the annoying enemies in Sonic 2. But not as bad. I wonder if there's stuff that I'm supposed to be, like, looking out for. You know, things hidden in the levels. Because it feels like there's a lot of different paths, but you could easily run straight through everything. Oh, okay, that's new. I keep trying to do the um, the shield attack from Sonic 3, but that is not in this game for anyone who was... Oh, should we go and try and do that? Let's see what goes on in this one. Collect the medals. Okay, we got another one of those Sonic 1 style spinning stages. With some very nice relaxing music. It's kind of weird how smooth it is, because I'm so used to these stages being really choppy on the Mega Drive. Okay, that's a bit dangerous if you touch them even once. There it is! Let me in, let me in! Yay, we did it! Another very easy one. 
three more medals and I still don't know what they're for yet. Speed Jungle Zone. The most generic name for a Sonic level ever. Ah, get off! There's like an old spring that was stuck into the wall there. I don't really know what to expect in the rest of the game, because I've seen both of these levels already in like demos and trailers. But I've not seen anything that comes after this. So I'm very excited to see what's next. That was nice of them to put a whole set of them at the bottom to catch you. We're going higher. Yay, we're out. Classic Sonic corkscrew. I did have the chance of playing this on the weekend at EGX, but I chose not to because it was coming out in a few days anyway. Hey, Tails is back there. He's playing his own game. I presume this is just a multiplayer cosmetics thing as well. I got this in the box. Something about a Lego Dr. Eggman that you can use that code for. Oh, ah, that's cool. Uh, go! I can't get up there. Oh, I didn't know you were at EGX. I would have said hi if you were there. If I knew. I don't think I got enough footage to do a video on, really, but... I'll talk about it at some point. Uh, am I allowed to stand down there? I don't know. I'll try not to. Oh, okay, it's just for him to latch his beak onto the floor, I guess. Uh, that's an easier way of doing it. Oh, you were asking... Oh, sorry. I'm only glancing at the chat. I didn't quite read what you'd put there. It was okay. There wasn't anything super exciting there. I mostly just went there to... to meet up with people. And to give Quang back his wonder swans. And I got a free creator's pass, so I thought, why not? It's a fun weekend. That was the most fun thing, was the uh, Mario Wonder booth where you got to play around in the giant pipe and have pictures of you taken. And me and Quang were having fun in there. And I got, oh, the best thing about EGX. I was so excited for this. Um, oh, I didn't see what happened there. That's something about Act 1. Yeah, honestly, EGX isn't as good now it's at the Excel Center. It used to be much better when it was in Birmingham. It's got a lot smaller. I used to go every year when it was down here. But obviously it's a lot closer for me, being in Birmingham. Um, uh, what was I going to say? Oh yeah, something really, really cool at EGX. I got to see a... Am I supposed to just be running away from him? A 25th, I think it is, 25th anniversary of Banjo-Kazooie Talk. And they had all the original devs there, and it was so fun to, to listen to them 
talk about how they made the game and all the thoughts behind it and all the cancelled projects and things. Oh, it was so good. I, I loved listening to that so much. I hope it's been recorded, because I would love to listen to it again. Okay, there is a reason to explore, because that's where you find the things to get the Chaos Emeralds. I can't tell if I'm getting closer to it or not. It feels like this would be cool on the uh, on the 3DS if this was in 3D. Yay, we did it! I don't know where the challenge is in that. You just swing around. Bam, 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 bam. I probably missed my chance to get enough at the end of the game. Uh, does it feel like a Sonic game? Um. When it's just platforming, sure, but all this, all this weird stuff that's going on, not really. Like, I, I guess it kind of does. Maybe these are kind of like wisp powers. Maybe it's like if Mega Drive Sonic met Sonic Colors. With a bit of Sonic 4 thrown in as well. And a bit of Sonic Mania thrown in too. I'd say, maybe it's a bit early to tell, but I'd say like, this is what they were aiming for with Sonic 4. Except they actually pulled off the physics this time. The physics feel great, that definitely feels like a Sonic game. So yeah, depends what you want from a Sonic game, but I'm enjoying it. Ah! Uh, okay, I thought that was going to be a pit then. And I suppose these are like the Metal Sonic levels in Sonic 4 Episode 2. Oh, I could have used that. Whee. I will say I feel like the camera's zoomed in too much. They could have they could have zoomed it out a little bit, just so you can see a little bit further ahead. But it's not the end of the world. I suppose having it like this matches the kind of uh, screen space that you'd get in in a classic Sonic game. Oh, there's nothing up there. I thought I was being clever then. Yeah. Yeah, maybe that's a good way of putting it. It kind of feels like how the Sonic Advance games look. Because they were in widescreen. So maybe the ideal way to play this is in handheld mode on the Switch. Invincibility. Oh, we haven't heard this song yet. Oh yeah, there we go. I know what else this reminds me of, in a weird way. It kind of reminds me of Mega Man 11. In the fact that, like Mega Man, the previous attempt at doing one of these style games was like the originals. And then this one's fully 3D, but still retains some of the same gameplay. But at the same time, maybe it's not quite as memorable. 
And this almost feels like a Mega Man level, running away from a laser and having to break down walls and stuff. Oh, was I supposed to save them? Two birds, one stone. What was that for? Use the gold plate to reveal a hidden item box. Cool. Stardust Speedway, that's the level that I was thinking of. Thank you, M players. Not going around to playing Mega Man 11 yet. Got it on the Switch. Mega Man 11's great. Well, they're all great. Honestly, I haven't completed Mega Man 11, despite me being a big Mega Man fan. Yeah. Thank you for reminding me what level that was. Here we go, Speed Jungle Zone 2. What is the gimmick this time? We have to navigate in the dark. Oh no. And I was complaining about a narrow field of view. And now it's gone. I think I missed a special stage or a bonus zone there. I guess I come down from there. I really miss the uh, shield ability from Sonic 3. I keep double tapping the A button expecting something else to happen. What is going on here? Is this like an endless pit? Am I supposed to be coming out of it? Why is there an Eggman death symbol? Do I not trust that speed booster? I took it anyway and I seem to still be alive. Cool, what do you think of the game so far then? And I guess the same question to you as well. Do you think it feels like a Sonic game? Do you think they did a good job? What's going on with this? Oh, okay. Is that all? That seems a bit easy. I was thinking that I would have to time it properly or something. Uh, okay, I guess they're kind of like Donkey Kong Country Barrels then. Oh man, I, w I really want another Donkey Kong Country game. Come on, Retro. We know you've been working on something that's not Metroid all this time. Where's Donkey Kong Country Returns number three? We need another trilogy. You can't tell me they spent six years just to put Funky Kong into Donkey Kong Country with Tropical Freeze. They must have been doing something else. Whoa, what's going on now? We got like a Virtual Boy gimmick going on. What is this shield I've got? Is this... The uh, rings thing. I haven't found any special stage for a while. I guess they're kind of hard to find. Whoa! I latched on somewhere. They're probably hidden somewhere down those endless pits, aren't they? Whoa, okay, that's an interesting boss design. Ah. 
Oh, cool. Oh, is that it? You just have to try and get him to hit himself. That's a pretty fun idea. Kind of like that Sonic and Knuckles boss at the end of Sandopolis, is it? And then I just have to stand like that. I like it. This is a fun boss. Um, speaking of Sonic, can't wait to see the entries for the hacking competition. Yeah, I always love seeing what comes from that. Oh. I didn't have time to adjust there. I presume I'm meant to be aiming for the blue one. Oh no, oh no. I was getting complacent. I'm going to stand right in the middle this time. I'm loving the creativity in this boss fight. This is really fun. Poop out your missiles. Oh, you have to actually aim it as well. Cool. Oh my god, it's still not done. Ah! My one ring. Why can't I get extra hits in? It's a cool fight, but it's uh, quite a long one. Yay, there we go. Speed jungle complete. I applaud Eggman for his ingenuity. Now I'm excited to see where we go next, because I don't know what comes after this. I'm glad they kept the same jingle at the end. Okay, where are we going now? Up into the sky. Is it a windy valley but in 2D? That'd be cool. Oh no! I like these little cutscenes after the stages too, that's so cute. Come on, where are we going next? Sky Temple. Another thing that reminds me of Sonic Advance 2. That really slows your momentum down. Can I get up there? Oh, okay. Is it the higher you jump from there? The uh... I'm just trying to work out how this works. Okay, you can press X. You can jump to get a little boost in the air. That's an uh, interesting mechanic. He's floating very slowly. Okay, I thought that was going to cause a uh, bolt of lightning to come down. I'm loving the gameplay. The physics feel absolutely perfect. <gasps> uh, that was close. Oh no. Are they going to grow back? No. Okay, we have to take the low path then. Which is never advised in a Sonic game. You always want to try and go as high as possible. Special stage. It wasn't very hidden. Alright, let's go and catch an embl emblem? Emeralds. They don't do emblems anymore. Sega's forgotten all about emblems. Okay, now there's a bit of a challenge because you have to watch out for spikes. Yay, we did it. That's three, is it? Or four? M players, what do you think about the uh, special stages in this game? They're very different. I quite like it. And we've got another secret power called Vision. Reveal hidden items. Okay. Found some hidden platforms. How would you know when to use that? Hmm. I feel like I'm just going to forget that exists. 
I need to remember I've got all the other ones too. I'm not sure when you would use them really. I feel like most people are going to forget they exist. Like... How would you know when to use it? I'm supposed to be going left. I don't like going left. Okay. Oh, it tells you what to use and when. Okay, interesting. We can only go in a straight line. Hey, we found one. And then it was saying around here to swap to the uh, invisible items one. I don't feel like I needed those, but... I'm loving all the different gameplay mechanics. Like, like, what is this? It's turned into Sonic Breakout. This is crazy. Oh, I love it. Is there going to be a pinball level later though? That's the main question. It's not, not a proper Sonic game without a pinball level. I'm going to do a video about Sonic Adventure 2 this week, but maybe I'll do a video about my thoughts on Sonic Superstars instead. I could probably record one tomorrow, depending on how far I get through this today. Oh, okay, I didn't even expect to find anything there, but let's go! Oh, this is new. Do we have to worry about anything? No. I do not understand what the point of that was. Oh, just a teleporter. A weird teleporter. What is going on now? Why is it telling me to use that? Okay, let's go back over here. Want to go even higher? I found a tornado! What the hell is going on? Oh my god! Wow, this is crazy. Now it's like Sonic 06. Oh my god, I think we found a secret! Wow, that was awesome! We got another cool boss fight. That was so fun, I love using the different power-ups now. And now that it actually tells you when you can use one, I'm not so bothered about forgetting they exist either. It's just fun new ways to manoeuvre through the environment, I suppose. Can I hurt him? Not yet. Yes! That was a nice shot. Turned into a bullet hell. 
we're going to do it again? Oh no, we have to climb up there. With more to dodge. This boss is really fun as well. I'm really loving all the boss fights so far. Oh, that was kind of narrowly dodged, that one. All right, let's climb up again. Go this side this time, because that's where the rings are. Why are they floating away? No! <gasps> That's not fair! Oh, we're gonna do it all again. <sighs> At least it's nice enough to give you some rings. Right, I'm gonna have a sip of my drink and get rid of this spider. Try and get it out of the room. He's gone somewhere. There was a spider crawling up the screen. I tried to throw him away. Okay. Let's go again. Got something tickling my nose. Oh, we can skip it. Cool. You can hold down X to uh, skip the intro to that fight. There's a little bit of a delay when you're floating through the air, if you're wondering why I found it a little bit difficult to dodge them. I need to be more patient, I think. Whoa, that was close. Got three hits in straight away. I really need to be careful now. I'm back down to just one ring. Oh no. I was hiding behind the score display there. Why are you so violent, Eggman? Calm down. Uh, oh my god. Okay, I got one at least. That's how you're supposed to do it. Okay. Wait for it to lock on, I suppose. Yay, we did it! Sky Tempon complete. That was actually a kind of challenging fight, too. No super peel out. I just found out. What's Astro Boy doing there? Or Astro Bot? Or Mega Man? Why are they just carrying around random robots? Alright, where are we going next? Pinball Carnival! Yeah, I knew there'd be a pinball level. Here we go. With some super funky music too. 
Yeah, you can tell this is a T. Lopez track. The funk is strong on this one. Was that Tails down there? What's he doing? Just floating around. It's kind of weird that he doesn't follow you, actually. Nothing super unique about this particular pinball level just yet. Hopefully there'll be something interesting or different about it. I mean, that's new. Yay, what do we get for getting everything? A whole bunch of rings. And one of those medals. Cool. Which I still have no idea what they actually do. Something about unlocking multiplayer costumes. Whoa! This wants me to go left for some reason. Okay, big arrows, I'll listen to you. We're gonna go in a cannon. Whee! It actually looks like a pinball table this time. Unlike a lot of the other pinball levels with just random things dropped around everywhere. I was saying earlier, I hope there's a pinball stage. So my Sonic spinball dreams have come true. With a bit of Sonic CD style spinning discs in there as well. Don't know where I'm trying to go. Hey, we found a special stage. Let's go grab another em emerald. I keep saying emblem. They're not emblems, they're emeralds. Okay, what's going to be the challenge on this one? Do I have to worry about... Hitting the... Oh, I suppose you just have to try and get past them. Okay, that's the challenge. Oh no, I ran out of time. Was I supposed to be getting the rings to get more time? Do I get a chance to retry? Nope. Oh, okay, classic style. We're not going to be able to retry it. Okay, I take back any complaints that I had that they were too easy. I like this new pinball thing where you have to light these... I don't even know what you'd call them, score? Sc score buttons? It reminds me of my game Super Donuts, because I had a... I think I took it out in the final game, but in the uh, prototype anyway, I did, I did build a pinball style level with those sort of bumpers. But I never really ended up using it in the end, because it was a bit difficult to control. Whoa, what is going on here? We've got a fireworks display. This is awesome. Wow. Is it boss fight time? We'll fight an evil clown. What do I have to do? Turn them all the other way around? Ah, <laughs> cool! And that's what hurts him. Awesome.
Why am I getting points for hitting him? I love it. These boss fights are so unique and interesting in their mechanics. This is fantastic. on fire. What the? He turned into a giant pig. Yeah, there's actually quite a bit in this game that's reminded me of Sonic 4 in a good way. And I've been thinking about replaying those two as well at some point. Because I really don't hate them as much as... What's going on here? Act pair? Using one fruit to play the act. I don't understand what this means. What does this mean? Anyone who's watching, what am I being asked here? What is this? Act 2 or Act Fruit? I don't get it. <laughs> Look at that pig just... wobbling around. I guess I'll just pick that one. Because Act 2 is next? Oh, I could have gone to a bonus level. I was worried it was going to skip something. Wow, oh, that's a bit unfair. Did Dimps make this game? Oh, we've got some weird music going on. Whoa, okay, I didn't expect it to go that fast. I'm scared to jump. I presume I can. I like the animation on Sonic's quills there when he was going fast. Oh wait, it was telling me to use something here. Hidden platforms. We get to go on another roller coaster ride. Whee! And what's the purpose of doing that? Changing where the fire comes out of, I suppose. Hey, we found another emerald. Uh, the fruit you get from the prison capsule unlock it. Oh, damn. Okay. If I see another one, I'll try and use it. So should I be aiming for the uh, rings more? It keeps turning! It's kind of hard to steer. Oh, really? I thought that would help a lot. Okay, I don't know how that helped me get closer to it, but yay, we got another one. There we go, we're halfway done. 
We unlocked a water power. Cool. I like the fact that the emeralds actually give you something in this one. Turn into liquid. Flow like water. Interesting. Is there going to be a chance to use that one here? I guess you can use that back on the first level. I wonder if there's any point going back to replay previous levels then. If you're being given power-ups that help you explore the levels that you've already been to. Is there stuff to do on them in the future? What's going on here? Got some more fireworks. Hopefully it gives me the option to revisit that special stage that I missed. And I completely missed all of that section. Damn it. Okay, and all the bonuses. Woo. Nice, and a whole bunch more there too. And now another roller coaster ride! Right, with enemies. Okay, it is safe to jump. Okay. And I should have gone up here! Okay, cool. Now we're going on another one. Uh, okay, going up. Oh my god. There's no time to react. Oh, I could have stumbled on that one? Is that what it's saying? Can I reach that? Oh! I was being too... I was being too clever there, wasn't I? It was my own fault. Well, we get to do this again. Enjoy the roller coaster for the second time. Oh my god. The rings just disappear instantly. Let's see if we can jump off just at the end this time and try and get on that. I wonder if there's anything else if you stay on that bottom one too. Whoa! Okay! I shouldn't have done that. Okay, <laughs> I didn't expect that to happen. Oh no. Alright, we're back again. Let's try it for the third time. And I won't jump at the end. Oh! Oh well. Ha! Huh, Amy's up there. I missed it that time. You got another one. Whoa! Why are there explosions everywhere? I thought maybe I could use the uh, fire thing to get through it. What's that blue one? Is this just a random special stage? Oh, it's another one of these ones, okay. Just to get a medal instead for whatever they're worth. And that was a lot easier. <clears throat> Got medals! Got five medals. For doing nothing. You love the opening notes to the level. This bit. I presume I'm supposed to be going down. 
very funky track. I like the music. I feel like there was supposed to be one of these roller coasters there. Oh, okay. I'm scared. I missed my chance for the better set, I suppose. Oh my god, don't give me any warning. Whoa, okay, this is getting crazy. What has he invented this time? Something carnival themed. What's going on? Oh, do I use it to hit him? Ah, fun! I love this. I love the way all the bosses you're actually using their attacks against them. so much that time. Okay, well we got like a skipping rope challenge. I hope they make this style of Sonic a regular thing. If they can do new 2D and 3D ones. That'd be brilliant. Where's it gone? Cool, we have to use both of them now. I feel like now they've got the formula down, they could easily pump out a new 2D and 3D Sonic game, especially 2D. They could pump out a new 2D Sonic game every year or two. Like they did back in the day. Like Sonic 1, Sonic 2, Sonic 3. They've confirmed two more games for 2024. That'll be brilliant. If they manage to keep up the uh, this level of polish, at least. Okay, we got one of the fruits. I'll try and use it this time. And Billy Hatcher, we rescued a chicken. Okay, is it going to give me the option? Nope. For some reason, we're just going going straight to a water level. Lagoon City. Get in Labyrinth Zone vibes from this one. Are they platforms? Oh, I'm. I bet I'm supposed to use the water ability. Oh, it's also reminding me of. I can't remember what the level's called. The one in Sonic Rush. In the water. Something Palace. You know which one I mean. Twelve? What's going on? Okay, apparently there's just a random box that you need to mash the uh, jump button on. You can go to the world map if you press square after a level. Okay. And what's on the world map? Is that how you can spend the tokens to go to the special stages? Okay, after this level, remind me and I'll go back to the world map and we can 
have a look at what goes on there. Where am I supposed to be going? Uh, I don't know. Is that it? These are all very easy so far. Dun, 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 dun. We are back in Lagoon City. I just realised there's no lives counter. Does it not have lives anymore? What's the point of collecting the rings? Can you spend them on anything? They just keep going. Ah, I know what I can do. <laughs> That's cheating, but it works. I suppose the idea is to use the water one, but fire will do the same job. Another special stage? Let's go back in. What does everyone think of the game so far? Are you enjoying watching it? Is anyone planning on picking it up for themselves? I'm honestly having a blast with it. I'm really enjoying it. Oh, I nearly f found my first uh, exit there before the end of the level. And now we're good. I hope there's something fun to spend all these medals on, because I'm accumulating hundreds of them. Oh, that was a bit weird going down the stairs on this. Can we get through there? Don't know. Did it, and now we're dizzy. Why are some of them electrocuting you and others don't? My sonic muscle memory then just made me want to jump off the top of that. That's how you get to all the best bonuses. I think I missed a checkpoint. Oops. I was trying to be clever then. I'll try and actually focus on what I'm supposed to do rather than just cheesing my way through the site, the, the fight, which is what I like to do. This is a weird fight. Do they need to come down and recharge? Oh, I thought I missed it then. That was close. Okay, that was actually really easy. Can we save the... Is it a walrus? Yay! 
whatever it is, we saved it. Is there any way of knowing where the secret boxes are? On Sonic 3, I used to know where to make them bounce in order to get the secret boxes. Right, I'm going to try the world map then. Let's have a look and see what that's like. We got another fun little cutscene. Cool. Okay, new products have arrived in the shop. Metal Sonic Blue. Go to the shop. Sure, why not? Let's see what's in the shop. Head, body, arms, legs, accessories, colour, pattern, prototype. I don't know what I'm looking at here. Choose a head. Choose a body. Is this like build your own character? Choose arms, choose legs. No accessories. Choose a colour. Or Oh okay, that's the robot that they were carrying earlier. Okay, well let's buy the Metal Sonic head, obviously. Okay. What do I do with it? Triangle? Okay, you can build your robot, nice. There we go, we have the most basic Metal Sonic ever made. Is that it? Do we get to play as him? No? So... Huh, I like that. Okay, so that's what the world map looks like. I really like it actually, nice and simple. Very bright and colourful, and everything's separated out into its own little island. Why does that one only say Act 1, though? Is that the secret door? Let's try. Uh, okay, I've got two fruit. Nice, we get to use one of them on here, then. Whoa, okay, what's going on here? I have a whole bunch of stuff. Bridge Island Zone, Act Fruit. Uh, okay, it's an auto scroller. So, try and get as much money as possible before the end of the stage. Okay, and I'm not allowed to touch the uh, bottom of the stage here. Oh, I'm getting scared now. Am I doing good? I don't have anything to compare myself against. Maybe I should aim to get these 30 ones. Okay, I think we did good. I got a fruity frontier, whatever that means. Clear the act fruit. SS Kento's here, howdy. Howdy, partner. How do you do? Come to check out some Sonic superstars? I think I did well then. Is this new? Yes, it came out today. I've been very excited for it. I take it you're not a big Sonic fan then. New products arrived in the shop. Emergency vehicle light. Okay. Uh, no, I don't have any money to spend in the shop. So, shall we just carry on from where we left off? You're a huge Sonic fan, but you haven't been counting down the days till Sonic Superstars came out. Oh my god. You need to get on it, it's fantastic so far.
Okay. Oh, we get to play as Amy. Nice. I wasn't expecting that. What is going on here? Uh... Okay, SS Kento, the rest of the game hasn't been like this. I'm not sure what's going on here. We are attacking fruit. For some reason. I'm guessing this is just some sort of... Minigame thing? Why am I getting points for it? What's happening? There doesn't seem to be a way of using the hammer without jumping either. Supposed to be going down here? I don't know. Amy gets a double jump though, which is pretty cool. Sonic doesn't get this. Oh my god, I thought I could do the entire stage without touching the floor then. There we go, no one wants to suffer through the horrible drowning music. Oh, I almost went too far then. Hey, we're back out. Does Amy have access to the special powers too? Yeah. Let's see if they still work. Yeah. Awesome. Let's go as high as we can. I don't think I'm supposed to be going this way. We found some more giant fruit up here. Yeah, that's something else new for this game, is this sort of wheel of power-ups. You get a new power-up every time you unlock a Chaos Emerald, which is pretty cool. They're kind of like the Wisps, I guess, but you can choose to use them whenever you want. Which is pretty fun. I definitely think the Fire one is my favourite so far. What is this? Donkey Kong? Whee! I love these weird water loops as well, like... How do you explain the gravity on that? Don't question it. Game logic. Ooh, special stage! Ah, have I missed my chance? No, we can get back up there. Is it still there? No, we missed it. Let's see what's up here. That's it, we're at the top. I thought there might be, might be a secret level up there. There has been in the past. We hit something off screen. Am I getting anything for hitting all this fruit? I hope so. There's a medal. Now I know what we can actually use the medals on. We'll try and get as many as we can. Oh, there is actually a counter for all the fruit as well at the bottom of the screen. Oh, I did that the wrong way around. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. This level's weird. Uh, apparently I was not going the right way because I'm now making my way back up again. Okay. I won't jump off this time, I'll just let it take me wherever it wants me to go. Well, we have passed 100 fruit. Uh, 
And the level is just going on and on and on. Five minutes in now. What happens when you get a hundred? Nothing at all. I don't even know what happens when you get a hundred rings now because there's no lives anymore. I think you get one of the medals that you can spend in the shop. Whoa! Let me back up. Oh, it won't let me use it twice. That's no fun. There's one there. Okay. Am I not heavy enough? Uh, what do I do for work? Sure. Um, easy thing to say as a software developer. Uh, mostly using Power Apps and Power BI and SharePoint and things like that. Uh, maybe I was supposed to bring one of the trolleys down. So yeah, I do have a day job. Nine till five. Hence why I start streaming at half seven. And why I've only got time to make one video a week. Even though I would love to do more. Or bigger. Oh yeah, this is something new for this game as well. These sort of metal challenge stages. That break up the action, which is pretty fun. So, yeah. For, for my day job, it's not the most exciting thing. I'm basically building document solutions for housing management companies. But it pays well, so. And I'm good at it, or I think I am anyway. But obviously I would love for content to become something full-time, if that's even a possibility. I have no idea. Maybe one day. But yeah, the, the amount I make on YouTube and stuff. Shall I take the robot over there and drop him on the Switch, maybe? The amount that I make at the minute isn't anywhere close. Whoa, okay. I don't need to drop him. Am I going to have to carry the robot the rest of the way? Whoa, she still manages to go really fast. Even with him on her back. Ah! Oh no, I don't have my hammer now. I can't stop the fruit. This level's so weird. Oh no! Ah! Yep, yeah, Amy is extremely strong. Oh, it really kills the acceleration though. What a crazy level though. This is so out of the blue. I'm enjoying it, but it's uh, unexpected to say the least. Okay, I'll well, wait there this time. Whoa, where are you sending me? Okay. It was a bit unnecessary. I can't go that fast! Or I can? I can go f too fast? Uh. Okay, he's happy to be dropped off there apparently. What a strange level. <laughs> so weird is that? Okay, we did it. Amy got through Act Amy. And she gave the robot an apple, even though he was right next to a giant one that he could just eat. And he doesn't even have a mouth. What's he going to do with it? Just hold it and be happy, apparently. All right. Are we back to Sonic? Yes. To the proper Act 2 of Lagoon City. Here we go. Ah, I didn't realise they were closing. Okay, it's telling me to use the water power up, so we'll uh, we'll try that. Oh, cool! Shoot, I didn't lose it straight away, did I? Okay, so there is some sort of swimming power up, which I just inadvertently turned off instantly. Oops. 
hopefully this counts as Sonic having air. Oh no! The collision is very... Well, obviously, because it's touching the side of the bubble. But... What's that? It's just a little rings bonus thing. Cool. Oh god, this is a bit scary. Okay, the magnet is basically the same as the uh, electricity. Am I supposed to be going down? Sometimes I'm not entirely sure where I'm supposed to be going in this. Uh, come on, please count as air. Yes. I think we've gone round on ourselves. Yeah. Okay, so the answer is not that way. Supposed to be going this way. Okay, here we go. Progress. Ah, uh, okay, we'll go down. Can't be a classic Sonic game without the terrifying drowning music. Special stage. Let's see if there's any difference to the underwater ones. No, nope, it's the same, except this one looks a bit more challenging, which is good. The other ones have been very easy so far. What's that? Whoa, okay. I don't know if it'll be easy to figure out when to use that. Okay, I don't want to go that way. To get up there. Ah, I thought that was going to be a game over zone as well. Okay, we did it. That's the first one. <gasps> That's not fair. How are you supposed to get through that? Did I get something? I got one medal at least. At least there's no emeralds at the end of that, it's just medals. So, don't lose out on too much. Oh, we get a chance to try it again. Okay. Oh, that's uh, a bit weird to control. Hey, that's fun though. We made it back outside. And with a whole bunch of rings. And I don't understand what these are. It's like a lucky dip. Lucky dip bonus box thing. Secrets. Let's go. Okay, we're back in here again. Oh, we're supposed to find one of those switches, was I, for that? Yay, we've got a new follower. Thank you, Virtual Slump. Thank you for the follow. I think I've just passed 600, actually, which is uh, which is insane, considering I only started this a year ago with no expectations. So thank you so much. Welcome to the stream, and welcome to... Welcome to my Twitch channel. Thank you for being part of it. Where am I 
supposed to be going? Up the waterfall? Whee! Oh wow, you can go up these too! Now it wants me to use fire. Oh my god, now there's a giant octopus? What's going on here? This level is crazy. You have to be really careful with this bubble. Right, we're going to take it a bit slower then, because I can't use the... Uh, uh, can I use it again? Yeah, I can. Wait. It's very twitchy controls when you're using this. Oh no, that's not fair! It just dropped me. Hey, we found an emerald special stage. Awesome. Catch a chaos emerald. Here we go. What? This one seems easier than the last one. Oh, okay. It's it's a bit tricky because it's higher up. Okay. Come on, stop spinning around. Oh no, there's nothing to grab onto! Ah, I never understand how to get closer. Am I getting closer? I don't know. I'm just going to run out of rings soon. Ah, oh, I don't understand. I don't understand why I missed it. I feel like I'm old. What is Dr. Slump? Am I missing out on something by not knowing what Dr. Slump is? Whoa, okay, there's a gold crab. Ah! It's difficult to tell when those platforms are up or down. Ah, uh, uh, no! Oh my god. Wait, I do know what Dr. Slump is. I've seen it before. Now that you mentioned who it was from. I don't know anything about it though, other than it's obviously got his very famous art style. Is it a million volumes long as well? Hey, we found one of the uh, fruits to take us to the weird level. Okay, that's where I'm supposed to be going. Oh, I only found that by accident then. Well, we're not allowed to swim, okay. Better than Dragon Ball. Give me the general gist of the plot. What's it about? At a high level, if that's even possible. Whoa! Okay, we broke through the wall. Should we do another mini game? And it's only 18 volumes. Maybe I'll actually check it out then. I've been meaning to find a manga to read on my iPad for a while. So. If you all recommend it, I'll give it a go. Oh no. Wow, that was a fail. Didn't get anything. Okay, boss fight time. I've loved all fights so far, so I hope this one's good too. 
can outsmart him with my water abilities. Ha ha! This feels like cheating. <laughs> I knew it would stop me at some point. Okay. I have to use the, uh... Whoa, 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 what's going on? I don't want to be there! Uh, are you gonna drop me? Okay, that was weird. Okay, it's just if you don't get out of there in time. Oh, okay. And you can also move up and down in there as well. Cool. There is a little bit of skill involved then. Ah! Uh, what do I think of the music so far? I feel like it's a little bit all over the place, if I'm completely honest. You can definitely tell that it was made as a joint effort by uh, Jon Snow and T. Lopez. Because obviously this is a very Jon track. Because he loves using those Mega Drive style drums. get hit in now? Okay, cool. And obviously I think Lopez's stuff is a lot more enjoyable to listen to because it's got a lot more different instruments and stuff. Whereas this, this boss music feels a little bit too generic, I guess. I don't know what was going on there. Okay, maybe I should save the uh, the water ability for a bit later. But yeah, what does everyone else think of the music? Like, if I just leave it here for a second, have a listen to this. I think this one's quite nice, quite low tempo, but it's all right. And then as soon as we get into this, listen to how the instruments change. You can tell it's a different composer. This time I'm going to save my water ability. Yeah, this doesn't really have the punch that it needs to be a boss music. It feels a little bit empty. Since I slowed down and I'm concentrating more, I'm finding this a lot easier now. Uh, no, that's not fair. 
Maybe this is where I should use the uh, use the water ability. Uh, is that cheating? It kind of feels a little bit cheaty. That's only slightly cheaty, surely. Did we get another piece of fruit? Yay! That means we get to go and do another weird level after. We got through Act 2. Hooray! Now we're going on the back of a dragon? Maybe? Sand Sanctuary. Going into the desert. Whoa! Like Mirage Saloon. I think that was the name of the level in Sonic Mania. Or Sandopolis? Oh, I think I missed my chance there. Is it Sandopolis from Sonic 3 and the Falls? Whoa, why are there razor blades in the ceiling? They're not actually meant to be going that way. I keep forgetting there's no shield when you double tap jump. Oh! Okay, that was my own stupid mistake. I jumped straight into that. Supposed to go there. Oh, like this. That works. Got a few bonus items. Is there anything else up here? No. Let's just play it Kirby style. How far can we just float across the stage? Oh, no way! Let me back! Let me back up! Oh, damn it! I might restart. I'm tempted to restart that level because I didn't know that was there. Right, let's do this again. We can get another emerald. If I remember what part of the stage that was. Yeah, and we got that this time. I like using the drop dash. It's a really good addition to the Sonic gameplay, I think. I don't remember going this way. Oh, maybe I did. Oh yeah, I did. I remember that bit. Because I jumped straight into that. I remember that. That works, I can just do that to get over there. I love the controls in this, they've absolutely perfected um, the Sonic physics. I mean, they are, they are slightly different. Do I... Uh, 
I just want to go. Please let me go straight to it. I refuse. Let me in here. That was good. All right, let's go. Catch the Chaos Emerald. Uh, one of the things you don't like about the game is the fact that all the characters share one save file. Does that stop you from playing through the game with all the characters? If you wanted to do separate runs? Because I, I was planning to play through it as, uh, as everyone else too. I keep getting really annoyed about this level. How am I supposed to get close enough to it? It's always out of reach. How are you supposed to get any closer? I literally can't. I'm pushing as hard as I can. Ugh. Uh. I'm not quite sure what you mean. Can't you just start a different save file and play it with them on that instead? Or is there only one in this game? With everyone. I haven't looked at the uh, title screen or the character screen or anything yet. I just went straight into playing it. Oh, I just realised I had no rings for a second. Ooh. Where did that come from? Let's see what's in here. Okay, we got another weird side-scrolling level. I think they're basically warps, but they just give you a chance to get a few rings at the same time. I don't really understand what you mean then. Can't you just use a different save file? There we go. We got there eventually. Is it going to go back up? Did I miss my chance to go up? I think I missed my chance. There was a whole bunch of stuff up there. worried about him. Oh no, I missed the missed the checkpoint. Ah, damn it. I hope I don't die on this boss then. I swear there's been a boss exactly like this before. Oh my god. How did I manage to dodge that? I won't complain. Okay. What do I need to be worried about? Why did he even show up?
Oh, he's very kindly filling back in the floor, is he? No. I don't really see the challenge in this fight. Uh, am I about to? They even put the floor back for me. And the enemies don't really seem to do anything. Weird, the music's stopped for some reason. My recording software just closed. For no reason. Uh, it's back. I'll press record again and see what happens. That was a bit strange. Did it record? Oh well, I think there goes my plans for doing a video review. It seems like the recorder broke. Thank you, Windows, I guess. Well, I'll record it from here on anyway. I can hear the game again at least. I wonder what happened there. Seems like the easiest boss fight so far. It's a bit weird that this one's so far into the game. Not sure when I'm supposed to be able to attack him though. Oh no. Thought maybe I was supposed to be able to hurt him then. Okay, what's going on in this fight? Why am I not why am I not able to hurt him? I don't get it. What am I doing wrong? And I need to find a charger for the uh, controller. I've got one here somewhere. There we go, we've got one. Oh, I'm really annoyed about the capture software. That's two times it's broken a file now. Charging. Yeah. Bounce the slabs back there. Oh no, it's not bouncing the slabs, it's bouncing them blue things. And hello, blue blue opal eyes. First time chat. Welcome. 
Yay, we did it. Why didn't I think of that sooner? Plug in. Is it charging? I'm a bit worried about that USB port. It seems fine. It's got a charging icon. Yeah, we got another one. He's so happy, look at him. Let's go. Ooh, where are we going now? To a factory level? Press factory zone. Whoa, okay. Getting wacky workbench vibes from this level. Everyone's least favourite Sonic CD stage. Hey, it could be pretty fun if you uh, if you time it right to do that. That's pretty cool, actually. I want to go down there and get that speed boost. Oh no! Ah, oh, that backfired! There we go. Got it. Oh, it didn't take us anywhere. Not fair. Let's do it properly. We There you go. It was worth doing. Can we go up there? Yes. Okay, that's a bit scary. I see where the bounce is coming from now. Let's see if this sends us flying into the sky. It didn't do anything! I thought I was going to get, like, catapulted then. I like that animation where he's pushing against the wall. It really looks like he's putting a lot of effort into it. Look at his feet. Uh Oh no! Ah! Uh. Why is there an Eggman face? What do I need to be worried about? Oh. It's just a trick. Oh, I suppose you just have to time it. Alright. Go, go, go! Easy. Looks like we're going to the background. Whoa, what's going on? Oh, that was pretty cool. I don't know what it was, but that was pretty cool. I'm enjoying this level. This is a fun stage. Maybe we can go up there. We wait for the uh, floor to boost us. Okay, in that case, let's try this. There's a whole load of levels up here. Oh my god. How high can we go? Or is it endless? I think it's a loop. Well, we got somewhere. Oh, that's not fair. That, that hit me away from... Something good. I'm conscious that I've missed so much by running through these stages. I feel like there should be a special stage hidden somewhere at the top. I like the extra challenge that... Oh, they don't jump, okay. I like the extra challenge that looking for the floor to bounce brings. Ah, oh my god, oh my god.
I like that as well. I don't think you uh, take any damage if you don't hit it properly. Okay, now what do we have? Like a gorilla robot. Oh my god. This is a bit scary. Kind of reminds me of the final boss in Sonic 1. Did that count? Oh god, scary. Uh, am I getting the sense of speed that older Sonic games gave me? There doesn't seem to be quite as many fast-paced segments as something like... Sonic 3? It, in a way, it feels more similar to Sonic 1. Uh, which isn't really a bad thing. I think the levels are really interesting in this game. There's a big variety of different platforming challenges, which is really enjoyable. So, yeah, I have no complaints. Maybe if you're just looking for a straight-up action game, rather than something that has a bit more platforming, you might be a little bit disappointed. But honestly, I'm having a blast playing through this. Really, really enjoying it. Oh, we can go to the special stage. Let's try the, see what this fruit stage is. I missed out on this last time. So when you collect a fruit in a level, it lets you access one of these bonus room, room things, which are like high score challenges, basically. Or at least I think they are. Let's see what this one is. Yeah, they're all sort of vertical challenge rooms. Try and collect as much stuff as you can without touching that bar at the bottom of the screen. Uh, would help if I understood what to expect coming from that. Okay, it's like the uh, like the bonuses in. Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Cool. Oh no. Hey, that was a good throw. Let's try and do it again. Not quite. Still got a bunch of stuff though. Pretty good. Oh, I missed that one. Well, we made it. 251. Not as good as last time. I think we got like 400 and something on the last one. But these are kind of fun little breaks from the uh, the main game. I like that. Here we go. We got four medals. And you can use the medals to buy costumes and stuff to decorate a robot. Not really sure what it's for yet, but... Uh, Okay, should we go and have a look and see what else we can buy with the medals? I don't think I've got that many because I spent loads on getting the Metal Sonic earlier. We can get a Metal Amy or a Robotic Bear. Actually, I can't afford any of them. Uh, we can buy accessories now. That wasn't on earlier. An emergency vehicle, like, for 200 coins. Or we can change the colour. Or you can uh, make a pre-made one. Let's see what we can actually buy with 11. We can buy some arms. Or... We can buy that. Let's buy him a body, because he hasn't got a body yet. So, do you want to see what my robot looks like so far? There we go. Pretty cool. Let's go back to the world map. I like the world map, I really do, even though you don't really get to see it. Where am I? Ooh. I think I just found a glitch. That is not supposed to happen. Oh no. Am I just going to fall forever? Oh my god. What have I done? Uh, 
Okay. So not only did my capture software break, but the game broke as well. I guess we'll have to go back to the main menu and come back in. Oh well. I haven't seen the main menu yet, so let's see what's on here. Story mode, battle mode, and time attack mode. And PlayStation Store. And options. Let's see what options we've got. Language, sound, controller. Sensitivity? Why would you need sensitivity? That's weird. And PlayStation Store. I didn't know you could buy stuff. Digital Deluxe Upgrade. Lego skin or a Lego fun pack. Okay. Back to the main story, I guess. Uh, where are we going now? Oh, that's the shop as well. We haven't done Act 2. Okay, back into the game. Let's go to Act 2. How many zones are there? If I'm in Zone 7, there can't be that much left. Ooh, scary Eggman drone in the background. Oh my god. Oh no, that's not fair. I didn't even see that. That's what you get for having the zoomed in camera. I'm not sure what the benefit of pressing that switch is. Seems to power something down. I better press that one so I don't get squashed, maybe. I don't know what it's doing. It's just turning the lights off. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. Oh, okay. So it's sort of like the thing with the ghosts in Sandopolis, where you have to press the switch before a time limit runs out. Cool. I like that. It gives it a bit of urgency. I wasn't sure if there was actually a lid on that one or not. Whoa! Where's it sending me? Starting to count down again. What's going on here? What is going on? I'm in a spaceship. Do I get to control it? No, it's just uh, uh, bouncing around everywhere. What is going on? Where am I going? Okay. Okay. I'll accept it. Just drop me off. What was it saying there? Telling me to use something. Okay. I can't even remember what that one does. What's the use of that? I think there was something up there. Oh my god, no. Something's gonna happen in two seconds. Uh, I'm scared! Right next to the damn checkpoint as well, and I just missed it. Okay, well, we'll get another chance to try using that special ability and see what it does. I, why can't I get up there? Oh, 
It wants me to use it here as well? Oh, okay. It just lets you pick that up. Ah, I hate these! Ah, good job there's no lives in this game. You literally can't see that. Oh, it doesn't go anywhere either. That's scary. It's supposed to go up here. Oh, right, you're supposed to go on the top of it. Cool. supposed to actually go on the end of that one. This level's kind of crazy. It's definitely the most difficult one so far. And I'm really enjoying the challenge, actually. This is really fun. Uh, oh no, no, the countdown started again! There better be a switch up here. Oh my god, one second to spare! Wow, that was close. That was so close. Whoa, poor Sonic. Oh my god, no! Ah! These traps, wow. Oh, I'm glad that didn't count as killing me. This level's kind of nerve-wracking. time again. Oh shoot, dead again. This level's crazy! Oh my god. Oh my god, this is horrible! I can't do this! Ah, oh, this is horrible! Come on! Seriously? Oh my god, this level's so frustrating. 
<laughs> I've lost all my viewers as well. I had ten a minute ago, and now it's dropped down to four. Do you really hate me suffering that much? <laughs> oh my god. I'm sorry. I thought I was good at Sonic. Is there another switch somewhere else? Is there a different path I can take? I'm focusing this time. I got this. Yay, we did it. Progress. Oh, I did do this bit, actually. I think I died just after this. I don't remember why. Oh, was it here? I can use that to press it again. Okay, time for another spaceship. Why is this one getting attacked? Now what's going on? I was expecting something that I need to dodge, but there's just rings. Okay. It was just nothing. Now it's time for the next boss. like that. Can I just stay up there? Uh... Whoa! All the bosses so far have been absolutely fantastic. They really nailed these boss designs. They're so cool. Okay, okay, that doesn't count. Okay, jeez, I get it. You're angry. I had so many chances to attack him before then. I have nothing to jump on. It's like a really easy version of the boss at the end of Sonic 2. I can't get over there. Oh, maybe I was supposed to use that to jump on. Oh well, we did it. Press factory complete. Another piece of fruit. Yay. Now we're on to zone eight. Oh, no, we're not. We're off to. Oh, we are. The Golden Capital Zone. This is a new theme. Nice. We're just going to be showered with gold. Okay. Is 
It's another pinball themed level. Was this just being nice to me after how hard the last level was? Where I'm supposed to be going. We can just use that, I suppose. Oh, I missed the special stage. Oh, cool. What are we doing now? We're driving. Nice. Another bit of the uh, Sonic colours shining through there. Except it didn't show. Drill! And the music didn't go insane. Is there any point in going up here, or am I wasting my time? I'm wasting my time. There's no reason to go that way at all. Whoa. Oh, nice. Now we're on the ceiling. That's cool. I didn't expect a gimmick like that. And now I'm in the background. This game loves playing with the perspective like that. Where's it trying to send me? I saw all those boxes. Is there anything else up here? Great, I got the shield just to lose it instantly. Oh no, there's the horrible enemies from Sonic 2. I was complaining about them earlier. I didn't know they would actually show up. There we go, that's what I wanted. I just wanted to see what it did. Drill time. I don't think there's any penalty for going through the rocks. Or maybe it means that you can't last as long? I like this level, but some bits feel a little bit empty, do you think? Like it could have done with a bit more time in development. It's just very big empty blocks with not much going on. It's just throwing money at me.
Whoa, okay, I was not going that fast. It just came out of nowhere. Okay, now we have a fight against a uh, money box pig. That was a weird fight. Okay. Whoa! Oh my god. Yes. What a reward. Huh. Okay. Interesting level. I'm not really sure what to think about that one. It was fun, but it was a little bit empty, I thought. Let's see whether Act 2 is any different. And we get to have a Knuckles level. Okay. Let's see what the Knuckles levels is all about. Golden Capital Zone. Act Knuckles. Whee! I haven't played as him in Sonic Frontiers yet, but I heard people complaining about how he controls. Being very awkward. What's going on with that? Do I just need to wait? Why not just be a spring? I can get them. Uh. Get all the rings. I've never bothered to fight them enemies properly. Oh. Is the point of this level just to teach you how to climb on the walls? What was that little circus trick? Who needs platforms when you've got walls? Where am I supposed to be going?
wants me to go left. Okay. Does it still want me to go left? This level is a kind of plain stage. I hate to say it, but there's not much going on. Just a very big empty level. I found a medal at least. So that's something. It's a shame they're not used for unlocking more interesting things though. I always like it when there's um, art galleries to unlock or something. Concept art, that sort of thing. That's my chance though. There's an emerald up there. Oh no, really, I missed my chance. Not completely. Maybe I did. They're not making this easy. Uh, I think I was close to getting back up. I forgot I even had that ability. Oh, maybe up there I can get back. I think I'm, I've gone too far now. Well, we got to the end. I don't really know what I thought about that stage. A little bit bland, really. found a special door. With some mysterious paintings on the wall. Knuckles' favourite thing. Mysterious paintings and emeralds. Ooh, what's going on now? Golden capital. There we go. I didn't even collect any gems, but sure, throw them down. He's really not very good at looking after them, is he? Act 2, now we're back at Sonic. Now we have a reason to go chasing after him. Even though Sonic hasn't actually met Knuckles in this game yet. Four. Three, two, one. Is that the gimmick for this one? Just doing things in order? Whoa, okay. Big fire. Is this, this game's equivalent of Lava Reef? I'll take that. I'm a big fan of Lava Reef Zone. Mm -hmm. 
Ooh, what's this? Something else new. Is it going to count how many rings I've got? Whoa! No, it's just going to shoot me into the sky. I like that noise. Well, sound effect, I guess. I did that very badly. countdown thing going on. Oh, I need to use the spikes. Hey, I did it. What do I get? Is there any difference to them? Do they make you go a little bit faster? How do you choose to go through the other bits there? Just stay on it, I guess. Whoa, what's going on now? This is like, um... Sky chase. Got more going on. Oh. It is like sky chase. It's even got the things coming around the corners like that. That was a fun little diversion to the level. We get another one of those weird loops. No, just a regular one. I don't know where it wants me to go. What was that? What? What, whoa, 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 what's going on there? It really wants me to have one of those ring pickup abilities. Uh, we got another countdown. Four, three, two, one. And then we lost them all. Hooray! Let me go back! Oh, that would have helped. Gone mad trains here. Hello. New Sonic's great. I'm really enjoying it. I think I'm near the end now. I'm on zone 8 or 9. I don't know how many there are, but it feels like I'm getting towards the end. Oh no. These are getting really challenging though, because you have to keep flipping things around using that. Try and hit that. There we go. I'm getting more used to it now. Never try to go through there. Oh. That one's going the wrong way. Hey, there we go. One medal down. Is that good? I don't know whether I'm going the right way. Not that way, not that way. Down here. There it is. We are going the right way. Getting dizzy at the same time. over there. Is 
Is that it? Oh no, I touched the wall. Uh, well, we got some anyway. How many did we get? Two. Back into Golden Capital Zone. Let's go. We got another flying section. Uh, whoa! We got the uh, the blog from Mario. What's he doing in Sonic? You don't belong here. Yeah, we got another medal. And another one. Ah! Oh my god! Too many! Make it stop! Wow. Okay, you're gonna let me land now? That was a lot. Oh. Just gonna keep going. Wait, have we got a fight in the in the sky? What's going on now? Whoa! Okay, we're back into the bullet hell. Amazing. I love how this game, you never know what to expect. It's always one crazy scenario into the next. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, okay! Okay! Ah! Uh. Oh, I can't hit him while he's up there either. Oh god, oh god. Oh, this is so fun, I love it. Now what's going on? Gonna get a chance to actually attack him again. Oh my god, there's a giant robot in the background. It's Mega Man. Whoa. Can I jump on him? I need to go down. Damn it. Another one of them break through the shields kind of things. That was a very ineffective shield. What's he gonna do now? More lasers? I come ah, oh, I was gonna say, if I go down from there, can I hit him from underneath? Yes! That actually worked. It was worth the risk. God, good job it falls slowly. I thought that bit before was a bit easy. No, this is insane. That ring bounced off nothing. I'll accept it. No, 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 we got missiles to worry about. Oh my God. They're fast too. Jeez. I hope I don't have to worry about the stuff coming from the ceiling, too. Uh, can I get in there? I'm gonna take my chances. Now I've got zero rings left. Oh my god, please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. I'm genuinely scared now. Ah! Did I. I got the trophy! No! Uh, I got the trophy and died at the same time. Oh my god, are we going to have to do all that again? <sighs> okay. Oh, how annoying is that? I can't believe that, seriously.
Oh no, now I've only got one ring. Already. I don't really think there's anything you can do to make this go faster either. I'm so sorry, everyone who's watching. You're gonna have to watch me do this again now. Hey, there's some extra rings at least. I really can't believe that happened. I'm so sad. Still, it's a really cool idea for a boss fight, so I can't be too mad. I get to experience this cool bit with the robot in the background again. Oh, I missed my chance to get hit in, I think. I don't know what, what killed me last time. Maybe I just shouldn't try and attack him when he's like that. Is he going to put his shield up now? I don't know what hurts me there. I'm just going to keep trying to do it as fast as possible. Now we have to go through the crazy explosive section. Are you ready? Again. Shoot, and I didn't pick any up either. Uh, uh, <laughs> no. Uh, I'm going to actually try and save some more rings this time. I can't believe that happened. At least I have myself to blame for that one. Not like the first time where I just died right at the end. Completely out of my control. Right, there's some rings down here on the bottom right if I remember right. Down there? Yeah, there they are. Not too bad, we got nine rings, we can do this. Oh, that was close. Ah! We got one ring, we can do this. Or maybe not. Oh god, oh my god, oh my god. This is horrible. Oh, I almost thought I'd left that too long then. Ah, oh, okay, they, they count as a shield as well. I'm just not going to risk attacking him in that phase then. It doesn't seem worth the risk. Just stay up here during this bit. Easy. Easy. No problem whatsoever. Now we just have to dodge all the uh, lava for some reason that comes out of this building. It's a very dangerous building. That's the one that got me last time! No! Okay, we got some... Oh my god, this is horrible. Ah! <laughs> oh, 
okay, we got four. We got four. We're okay. Ah, oh, I need to remember to breathe. No, it does hurt you as well. Ah. Oh. I thought I didn't need to worry about the ceiling. What is going on now? How am I supposed to get underneath him? I'm not even going to try that. Oh my god, it's still going. I'm scared. I'm genuinely scared! I care more about the ring than hurting him. Oh, have we done it? I don't trust anything until I'm on the ground. We've done it. There we go. Ha ha ha. Now I can rest. Yes. I don't even care that we didn't get the, uh, the fruit for that one. Really cool fight, but a little bit unfair. I enjoyed that though. That was cool. That was very cool. I've loved all of the boss fights in this so far. They've all been absolutely fantastic. Definitely the highlight of the game, I'd say, is the boss fights. I have no idea what's going on in the story, really. Whoa, okay. She transformed into a... Super Dragon. Cool. What is going on? Do I have to fight this now? No, nope, Super Dragon saves the day. Did we get the emerald? Amy's reunited with a long lost dragon friend from high school. Weird, we never got to play as Tails. We got to play as Amy and Knuckles, but not Tails. Cyber Station Zone. Here we go. I knew there'd be a cyber-themed level. Ah, oh, how cool is that? Look at the rings! Look at the enemies! That's awesome. Ooh, nice. And we got, like, trampoline floor as well. Oh, I love this game so much. Thank you, Sega, for making a completely original 2D Sonic game. I'd never thought they would do it again after how Sonic 4 Episodes 1 and 2 kind of flopped. So I am so glad that they took a chance on a new, a new fully 2D Sonic game. I'm so happy. Not quite sure what's going on with that though. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, whoa! We got Voxel Sonic. Metropolis Zone. I think that's the name of it. There's a giant ring up there. We can get it if we do this. There we go. Time to attempt to get that stupid Chaos Emerald again that keeps getting away from us. Here we go. Just gotta intercept it. And how you do that is anyone's guess. Okay. 
keep holding forward, I guess, because you're constantly moving in the direction that it's heading anyway. Just keep going forward. I don't know how to get any closer to it, honestly. I've been trying on this one level for so long and I just can't get any closer. Come on, look, it's just out of reach the whole time! And I've used up all of the rings. There's nothing more for me to do other than try and move forward. I don't understand how to get any closer to it. Seriously. I don't know what to do! There's nothing else I can do! Has anyone got any idea what the hell you're supposed to do on that stage? I just can't... I can't move. It's so frustrating! I could have had like another three or four emeralds at this point. <coughs> I made myself cough from shouting too much. The stage is cool though. I can't stay mad at the bonus stage for being impossible to beat. Uh, okay, now we're a squid. I love that every single level has had a completely different gimmick to it as well. There's some really cool ideas in this game. Ooh, secrets. Oh my god, there is no escaping them. What? Okay, now we're a mouse, apparently. A mouse playing Pac-Man? This is so cool! Ah! Oh no, really? You're going to make me go all the way back to the start? Every single time something like that happens. Alright. Mouse powers activate. You can't get off until you reach the end either. Oh, is this a teaser for the mouse powers? To give you an idea of what to expect. Alright, let's go. It's like an arcade game in a game. Ah! Well, that's not fair. I don't know which way I'm supposed to go. Ah! And I was trapped! That's not fair either. No, just like the uh, arcade games of days gone by, I suppose. But there's unlimited lives, so it doesn't really matter too much. So I suppose I'm supposed to stay on this one... Are you? Yeah, there we go. We're free! Oh, really? I missed it by like a second. Uh, rush, they're all dying. There's so much stuff that you'll just miss because you haven't got time to react.
Back to squid powers again. It's easier to control than the uh, swimming power up. I say as I get hit repeatedly. Now what's going on? Now we're a spaceship. Whoa! Oh my god, that's fast! Uh, I guess it can be even faster if you hit them. Uh. <laughs> okay, I'm doing okay. Whoa! Now we're back to normal. That was crazy. Cool music. Now what's going on? We have Eggman and Metal Sonic. Oh no. Got it. Ah! How was I supposed to react to that? Oh my god, this looks so cool! I am loving this. go over the lasers then? Is it just the floor I needed to worry about? Oh god. No, it's speeding up. Uh... Ah! Oh, I didn't notice that! No, I lost all my rings now! Oh my god, that's not fair. Okay, well at least we know what to expect this time. Let's try again. This is only Act 1 as well. Act 2 is going to be crazy. Alright, let's go. I thought I'd got past that. Now I've only got one ring. Ah, did I miss a hit? Yes. Got to use the uh, drop dash. I keep forgetting I have that. And, yeah, you can jump through the uh, lasers. So the other thing I need to think about is don't get stuck at the edge of the screen, because that's where the lasers come from. Whoa! Okay, yes, I remembered that this time. Uh, oh, no! My ring! My one ring! Okay, we're safe. Him. Awesome. I didn't actually expect to uh, hurt him then. Oh my god. Ah, stop! I thought I was high enough for them. So I actually need to try and. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. This is scary. Just don't lose that ring. No. I don't know if there's any other chance to attack him apart from that. Oh my god, oh my god. 
so. Do I try and go from underneath or from above? Yes! <gasps> Have I done it? Uh, yeah, for some reason it dropped some rings for us too. I won't complain. Ah, oh, what a cool fight. Again. Oh my god, now what? All the Astro Bots are after me. What is going on? Ah! I managed to hurt him. Somehow. Yes, you can fire them back at him. Fantastic. I hate this. Ah! Oh my god, that was close, that was close, that was close. And I can get a hit there when he's destroying the floor. Awesome. <gasps> we did it! Okay, is this going to be another fake box? I think it was just kind to me then. I didn't really win that. We freed the giant pig again. And that was only Act 1. Wow. What a cool boss for the end of Act 1. Whew. That was awesome. Now we get to play as Tails. I was complaining earlier that we didn't get to play as Tails yet. So here we go. Frozen Blast. Oh no, what's Tails been up to? Frozen Base Zone. Oh, look at his... Look at his model, it's so cute! go that way, if that's the way it wants me to go. I thought I was wondering when I was going to get tired. Ooh, secrets! Let's go! I actually really like the graphics in general. They're very bright and cartoony. Even in what would be normally a dark environment like this, it's so colourful. I love it. Yeah, the level design... Oh, there's a, there's a ring down there. to get there. Yeah, the level design on the hole's been really good. Some of the levels earlier felt a little bit empty, but now we're further into the game. The, uh, the difficulties picked up and the levels are a bit more interesting as well. Whee. 
Not sure what I'm supposed to be looking for here. When the screen goes purple like this, it means that there's uh, hidden... Hidden platforms. <gasps> oh, that was scary. Oh, no. Yeah, I bet designing a Sonic level takes a lot of work. And they have to be really long stages, too, because of how fast you can go through them. dangerous now, I've got no rings. cool that you get to play as the different characters throughout Sonic's story. Oh, I don't think I was supposed to go in there. Oh, okay, it was, it was supposed to be part of the cutscene. Whoops, that didn't quite work right. Hey, It was a fun level. And we got an item box from the checkpoint. Hey, Even the sign looks nice, look at that. Love it. There we go. Got through act tiles. Now, what weird circumstances are he going to find himself in now? Just in a cold room, all on his own. Oh? Is he going to build himself a mech suit or something? He built Eggman's spaceship? Or fixed it? No. Oh my god, do we get to play as that with Sonic? What is going on now? Frozen base zone, act two. Oh my god, what? No way, it's fantasy zone! What the hell? Oh my god, I never expected to see such a blatant reference to Fantasy Zone. That's crazy. Oh my god, it's even got the weird walking things, no way. That's incredible. Wow. That's hilarious. I wonder how many people will get this reference. That's amazing. What the hell? I suppose it's only fair. Sonic Mania got Poyo Poyo. So they had to have some Sega game reference in here. This is just amazing though. There's so much... Just creativity in this game. I love it. <laughs> oh. This is making me so happy. Right, we've got to keep going round. Oh, I didn't realise I had that too. God damn it, I was using that the whole time. What? 
Now it's turned on to a full-on space shooter. What the hell is this game? Is this what Eggman gets up to in a spaceship before he comes down to Green Hill Zone? He's taking a lot of hits. Yay, just as I said that. I feel like Sonic Team just really wants to make a shoot 'em up. Because spoilers for anyone who hasn't finished Sonic Frontiers, but that ends with the shoot 'em up as well. What the hell is this super weird sound effect going on? We did it! That was the end of Frozen Base, apparently. What a strange level. Woohoo! I never expected any of that. That's so cool. Alright, it's into Eggman's base, I guess. Egg Fortress. Ooh, get some cool music here. Uh, am I supposed to be trying to destroy that? Yeah. Hey, it's like um, like Sparkster. Rocky Night Adventures. Ah. Oh, okay, cool. The uh, closer to the edge you stand on here, the further, the further you're going to move from one side to the other. That's a nice mechanic. Oh, bit of a glitch there. Weird. Ah, oh, almost. Wait. I'm going to try. Let's get back up there. <laughs> it worked! What is that? What's going on? Oh, okay. Completely zero gravity. So many weird ideas in this game. That does feel a little bit like cheating. Anytime, uh, I feel, anytime I feel like I'm gonna fall off somewhere. Oh, it's not cheating. The game allows you to do it. Oh my God, we got a Mega Man section. A little bit of Heat Man there. Wow. 
Can we get back up? Sure we can if we do this. Yeah, we're going in there. Okay. Okay, let's try again. Try again, again, again. Everyone in the chat, tell me, what am I doing wrong? Why can I not get this one? I've managed to get all the other ones. But this one is constantly eluding me for some reason. Am I going too high up? Is that the problem? Do I need to stay down the bottom where the, uh, where the blue things are? Should I not be getting all the rings straight away? I'm going to try and go further down. When I was trying to get it last time, I never went back this far. Oh, really? You just need to let go? Oh my god, no way. Hey, first time chat. Love your YouTube channel. Thanks for covering Hime's Quest. No worries, I loved Hime's Quest. I'm not going to try and pronounce your username. <laughs> okay, we got a new power up. Ivy, finally. Grow climbable vines. Alright, let's see what this does. Whoa! Okay, they look- Oh wow, you can control them too. Cool. I love all these weird power-ups that this game has. So fun. There we go, we have another power. Whoa! Oh, okay, I'm not supposed to go that fast. Whoops. Don't want to do that again. I can't believe how easy that emerald was. Hey, we got a medal. How many different paths are there in this stage? Oh my god. It feels like you're closed in, but there's so many different routes you can take. God. I actually learnt to wait for that enemy, so it doesn't hurt me every time. Hey, Zombie Workshop! Thank you again for the raid! I really appreciate it. I need to start raiding people when I leave my streams as well, so... If anyone knows of any cool retro gaming... Uh, ...specific... ...Twitch uh, channels, then please let me know, because I would love to... ...get more into the Twitch community. Because I only really know about the YouTube side of things. But, hi everyone! What have you been playing tonight? I'm right near the end of Sonic Superstars now, I think. This might be the final level, so... You guys and girls might not be here for that long, but I hope you enjoy... Uh, what you... Can see of it. Because I, I am just finding this game absolutely fantastic. I've been loving every minute of it so far. Uh, seriously, it's... It's everything I wanted it to be. I'm so happy. Oh, really? The fire doesn't let you go through the fire? That's not fair. I thought I would be immune to that. Okay. I love how big this level is. It's crazy. Oh, we didn't have enough rings to get... Oh, okay, we got another anti-gravity zone. Let's go, you're playing a roguelike called Rungor. Nice. I've actually been researching a bit of the history of the roguelike or rogue genre for the book that I'm writing. So I might check that one out. I'm very curious to see uh, where developers get their inspirations from between the different rogue style games. Uh, and you played a few more demos as well. Was that part of the Steam Fest that you were checking out last time? Uh, next Fest, is it? Oh no, that's where I died before! Ah, uh, There's no warning that you need to slow down there. What? That's not fair. Good job there's no lives. 
I would have died a million times. Okay, I need to slow down. We got fruit! Yes, that means we get to visit another one of those uh, special levels. Mm. That's kind of what I wanted to cover in that chapter. The fact that a lot of them aren't really like Rogue. And a lot of the developers probably have never even played it. So maybe it needs to have a new name. Maybe something more like... Replayable... Danger game. <laughs> I have no idea what you would call it, but... I feel like... Naming a genre after a specific game... Isn't really great. It's the same thing with Metroidvania. I bet some Metroidvania developers haven't even played most of the Metroid or Castlevania games. And they're actually just basing it off other games that they like in that genre. That Sony existed, you know, after those games. It's kind of strange. So, if you've got any suggestions for a better name for roguelikes, let's hear it. Okay, I should probably let it land. What an awesome level, I love that. Ah. Procedural, random, fun time, danger game. I don't know what you'd call it. Ooh, what's going on now? Eggman's going insane with his egg timer. I love that I don't know what to expect in this game. Because I've played all the other Sonic platformers like a million times each. But every gimmick, every little thing in this game has been completely fresh for me. And what the hell's going on now? What? We've got to play the game in reverse? What the hell? I'm so scared. The, the are they the rings I picked up? Whoa, this is so cool! Oh my god, I've just had the biggest grin on my face the entire the entire night playing this. This is fantastic. Ah. Oh. The amount of brand new, fresh ideas in this game is incredible. Every level's had something that I've just been like, Wow, they really did that? Are they gonna change? Okay, slowly. Ha! <laughs> Even the uh, rockets are going backwards. Awesome. Get back here. I don't think I came this way, so... I'm not sure what to expect up here. I'm just trying to stay on the high route. Let's see if I can get back up. What happens to anti-gravity in reverse? Nothing. And I can't use my superpower either. Where's the fun in that? I want to blast through this bit. Ah, slow down. The music's really cool in this stage, too. The music's been a little bit hit or miss, honestly. Uh, Roguelike is more like twin-stick shooter. Uh, I guess so, but then there's also like dungeon crawling roguelikes, which are like top-down action-adventure action kind of games, too. I don't know. I think the whole genre needs a rethink. It's too broad now, really. Well, there needs to be, like, subsections within the genre. Oh, I was worried I didn't get that then. Oh no, now we need to do this in reverse. Let's try and stay on the side. And then, whee, swap over. Let 
me out. Let me out. Why did I have to go over that side? Oh, I thought I'd do it really cool then and drop dash the whole way. Damn, that's what I get for showing off. Okay, sorry, my mistake. Let me do it the proper way then. Be a bit more careful this time, then. Oh no! Oh no! I can't go too slowly. Oh my god, no! Ah! Uh. It's not fair. <laughs> that in the style of Evanescence. I was talking about Evanescence the other day, actually. It's like one band that everyone listened to in school and thought the words were so deep and meaningful. Something like that. I can't remember why we were talking about it now. Right, I need to go. Oh my god, I'm so scared. I hate this. Oh, thank God for that. Please be a checkpoint somewhere. Where are we going now? Is this going to unfall? Whee! Oh, no, 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 no. Do I have to fight that again? No. <laughs> oh, this is fantastic. I haven't got any rings! <gasps> no, the platforms are disappearing. Oh my god. Let me out. Oh, that saved my life! Still use it a little bit. Always take the higher route in Sonic. It's always safer if you can. All right, back into zero gravity. Oh no! I don't know what was going on there. I didn't know you could bounce off the walls. Is that a faster way to get around? Yeah, it is. No way. Why did I only find out about that now? Oh, that's not fair. I think we got a checkpoint. Okay, let's try this. Hey, it actually works. I presume this is the right way to go. It looks like you can go down more as well. But... So I just need to be careful of this. There we go. Now we are making progress again. I don't even know what's going on, really. Just push forward. Or well, backwards, in this case. Oh, we've got another one of these to contend with. This is a really long stage. I don't remember the forward version being this long. It must have been, though. Hey, we made it in one piece that time. 
first try. Okay, now what's going on? I think we're back at the start of the level. Is on reverse time. Don't tell me I have to go through it forward again. No. It's just going to be the boss fight. Okay, time for the next boss. The bosses have all been amazing so far. Oh my god, I'm so excited to see what this is going to be. This looks crazy. I'm scared. Okay. Always hit the blue ones back. I learnt that earlier. Why, why is he blocking them? Whoa! I thought they were going to be shields. Oh my god, oh my god. Ah! Am I doing something wrong? He just keeps blocking them. What am I doing wrong? Ah, oh, no, that's not fair. What do you think I'm supposed to do then if he keeps hitting the, uh, hitting the rockets back? Okay, let's try again and see whether we can figure this out. Do I need to hit them at a different angle, maybe? <clears throat> Alright, let's see what's going on. Oh! Oh, you just have to go behind him, okay. Easy. Is that it, really? Oh my god. So simple. Oh, he's mad. Oh my god, that is a lot of electric things and the platform disappeared. Yikes. I really thought I'd missed my chance then. It's quite lenient. He just stays facing the... Oh my god. Oh no. What is it? O-shape? I really want to play that at some point. I've had it downloaded for a long time. Am I going to get another set of rockets? Okay, here we go. Easy. Now the barriers? Or now his fists? Oh my god, what's going on? Where's the platform go? Ah, uh, where did the floor go? That's not fair. Alright, we know what to do this time. Apart from at the end, don't stay on the platform. Well, I couldn't get either of them. Oh, that was close. I wonder if there's any way of telling which of the uh, 
types of attack he's going to do. God, I've been losing all my rings. Is it going to be the shape one? No, I suppose if he turns back around straight away, then it's going to be something to do with his hand. And then it's all the electric balls. That was close. Uh, it's almost like I knew that wasn't going to work. Now we can hit him. And is it going to be the gates again? I suppose you don't need to run at this point, really. Oh, just through that little gap there. Okay, now. Oh, no. Okay, we're going to do this with no rings. Okay, think of this as another practice round then, I guess. There's no more rings. Is this going to be hitting the floor? Oh my god, oh my god. Well, at least we managed to get off the floor. Getting slightly further each time. At least it doesn't seem completely impossible, like the boss at the end of Sonic 2. Hey, don't say that! I can do it. I mean, it is half eleven, and I need to get up early for work tomorrow, so I don't know how much longer I can attempt to do this. But, I'm just going to keep at it. Screw waking up for work, no one wants to do that. Easy. Easy, easy. Bring it on, Doctor. Whoa! Whoa, they were a bit close together. Oh no. Well, we've got three rings. It's better than nothing. Now, is this the floor? No! Nope. I thought he was just going to stay there. Oh, that was close. Where's the blue one's gone? There it is. Perfect lined up as well. Right. Now, get in the gap. There's just enough time to do that. Come on. One more set of missiles. Get the blue one. I've got this pattern down now. Now he's going to lift up the floor. I'm ready. I'm ready. Bring it on. Go. That's how you do it. Ooh. Oh no. And the floor ended there. Right. Okay. We're back. We have stable footing again. No blue one that time. Oh, 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 oh. And again, no blue one. Oh my god. Where are they? Oh, not again. Oh my god, this is so tense. Right. Let's look at what side it's coming out. It's coming on the left. Ah, oh, I really thought I got that then. Does that count? 
No, he blocked it. Oh. oh my god, this is so difficult. He's going to block that one. And he's going to block that one. I'm just going to keep going. Come on! Okay, we got one more hit in. I've got no rings. Oh, this is horrible. Uh. Okay, we can do it. I just need to be fast to get in that last blue one. <clears throat> I shouldn't be screaming. Hurt my throat. Alright, thanks for dropping by and thanks for dropping people off as well. I always appreciate it. I'll return the favour whenever I see you're online. Huh? Don't forget the raid. I know, I just said. <laughs> Uh, I'm on the final boss. I don't know how many tries it's going to take, but I've made it to the end. I can hear you doing clickbait stuff, like, oh my god, I can't believe, oh my god, this is O'Ken, you YouTuber. It's not clickbait, it's true. <laughs> Come and see it if you don't believe me. So you have to dodge all these and get behind him. And then shoot that back onto his back, and then he'll do one of three different things. So, if it's this one, you just have to dodge them, and then he'll start firing missiles again. And you have to get round behind him. And the blue. Oh, I missed it. Hit the blue ones. There's one. And now he's going to put a saw down on the floor. Maybe. Oh, he's going to lift the platform up. Okay, so run this way. And the floor starts collapsing, and you have to watch out for all these lightning things. And the floor disappears on the other side as well. And then it goes back to the missiles. And you can see what sides they're starting on, because you can see where the blue one's coming out, so that one's going to be on the left. So that's the next phase. Now this phase, you need to do a spin dash right... Oh no! It wasn't the phase I was thinking. Now he's going to start firing them again. We have to go back around the back. Okay, on the left. If you're watching, I'm going to be able to do it now. I'm watching really hard! Watch harder! Okay, now spin dash, he's going to make the floor go into the air. And then you have to quickly go to the right, and keep going, and then dodge all the electric stuff without going off the end of the floor. Okay. Huh? You buy an edge to advance his back, that's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. fine. Now I need to get around the back of him again, and dodge all these missiles. I'm going to ignore that one, because they're coming on the wrong side. And now, this one's on the right. Yes! Got him! No. Oh, I didn't make it! We're doing well. I haven't got this far. There's going to be another phase. Oh no! His real head was tiny! <gasps> Small head. What a revelation. Small Is he overcompensating for something? Small he keeps reversing time. Now I'm going to have to do the fight backwards or something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Where's he got? Whoa! Oh no! I hate these kind of fights. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what to expect. Uh, someone says attack the flux. Ca Do I? Oh, I don't risk it. I don't want to risk it. Someone says attack the flux capacitor. What's going on? So we get zero gravity. That's been a thing at the uh, on this last stage. I can't hear anything. I think I was supposed to, maybe. Oh god, I hate this. At least I've got rings. Oh, why is it going so fast? Okay, that's when you get your hit in. Okay. He's gonna go into recovery again. I don't know if I can, because I can only do that weird little spin. I don't think that's enough to actually hurt him. I just have to float around him. Which seems quite easy. I don't know why this is so simple. And then just keep running away. And keep the timing right for those lasers. No, unless you jump off one of the platforms there, like that. Oh. This seems easier than the first half. Yeah, got him. And a small head. Don't be mean. He's very conscious of his small head. Uh, oh. oh, because he froze time or reversed it or something. There was a really cool level before this where you get to the end of the level and stuff's like collapsing all around you. And then he reverses time and all the stuff that collapsed is coming back up. And you have to try and dodge it before it squashes you into the ceiling. I wonder whether, whether I can attack him then as well when that stops. Oh, maybe. I don't want to risk it. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna attack him. Ah! Don't do two of them at once. <laughs> I bet there's already someone speed running it. I've been wondering that the whole game because ah. Don't tell me I've got to do the first bit again as well. Okay. Oh no, it's only the second half. That's okay. Oh no, it is both parts. Okay. It's fine. I know what to do now. Is it fine? I can't believe I have to do both parts. go all out on the final bosses. Oh my god, 
because I've lost all my rings. Oh, that was close. I expected that. Oh, I'm not going to be able to do this tonight, am I? doing badly now, I can't focus.
Oh, really? Again, I won't be able to hit him. Is that it? Phase 1 down again. Okay, now we get to try and take on Phase 2. And I have a little bit of a better idea as to what to do this time. I don't know how I got hurt last time because I only did that. I must have just gone into one of his spikes without realising it. Now, do you think there is any way of hitting him in this state? I don't think so, but I'm a bit scared to try really because I don't want to go back through the first half of the fight again. As long as I've got one ring. I didn't count how many attacks it took for the first phase. Was it four? What's going on? Oh. Zero gravity time, okay. Just stay near the back and it's not a problem. Thank God for the iframes there. Yes, that's three. <sighs> okay, time for anti gravity again. All right. Let's go. You're getting better.
Oh no! Oh, God damn it! Oh. Okay, one more try. If not, then I'll just have to finish it off stream because it's nearly midnight now. I'm going to try and do this first bit without losing any rings. I don't know if I can do this. Oh, I didn't think that would hit. Excellent. Okay. Phase one down. Six minutes to beat phase two? I don't think so. I'm just going to have to stop streaming after this, I think. I can't let it go on much longer. We'll see. Maybe I'll do it this time. I hope. I'm honestly putting my full focus into this now.
No. Okay, I'll do it off stream. I'm done. Is that the raid button? There we go. We'll send some people over to someone called Arcus. Apparently someone in the retro community that I found. So there you go. If anyone's still around, you can head over there and say hi to him. Thanks for watching. I'll try and finish this on my own tomorrow, I guess. That's a really sad way to end the stream because I really enjoyed it. But I'll let you know what I thought next week, I guess. Bye.